Published 2056 EDT, 1 October 2017 Updated 2128 EDT, 1 October 2017 Their string of number one singles made them arguably the biggest girl band of the noughties, and their split broke the hearts of millions of fans worldwide. But Nicole Scherzinger and her fellow Pussycat Dolls are finally going to to reunite after fractions in the group led to an almost decade-long split. Led by Nicole, but also made up of Karmic Batcher, Ashley Roberts, Jessica Sutta, Melody Thornton and Kimberly Wyatt, it was revealed on Sunday that the girl band are keen for a reunion and plan to put their differences behind them. Scroll down for video fair coming back Nicole Scherzinger and her fellow Pussycat Dolls are finally going to do reunite after fractions in the group led to an almost decade-long split a group insider told the sun talk of the girls getting back together has been rife for a few years now and they have finally found a time which works for them all. They are still deciding whether it will involve a full tour or just a handful of performances but they are excited to be getting out there together again. The girls feel the time is right to let bygones be bygones and put any differences they had behind them and celebrate the great songs they made. Mail in Line has contacted Nicole's representative for comment. Return of the Pussycats founded by Robin Anton III from Left, led by Nicole Center, but also made up of from Left, in 2005 Karmic Batcher, Ashley Roberts, Melody Thornton, Kimberly Wyatt and Jessica Sutta. It was revealed on Sunday that the girl band planned to reunite the group's debut single, Don Shaw, was released in April 2005 and topped the charts in 15 countries and sold over 7 million copies worldwide. Riding on the wave of the girl power phenomenon started by the Spice Girls in the 1990s, the dolls then went on to dominate the charts with catchy hits and sizzling music videos throughout the noughties with songs such as Stiquito and Buttons. They sold more than 50 million records before the split in 2010 which band made Karmic Batcher, 43, previously said was down to Nicole failing to confide in them about her battle with bulimia. Nicole went public about her struggle with the eating disorder during her years with the dolls in a candid interview in 2012. Big success Nicole Wright is currently filming the 14th series of ITV's hit singing contest with fellow judges Simon Cowell, Sharon Osbourne left and Louis Walsh though all of the girls have gone on to have relatively lucrative show business careers, the Hawaiian-born beauty, 39, has had by far the most success since the split, as a judge in The X Factor, West and Oliviera award-winning performer, and as a solo artist. Shes currently filming the 14th series of ITV's hit singing contest with fellow judges Simon Cowell, Sharon Osbourne and Louis Walsh. Rumors of the reunion with the other Pussycat Dolls have been gathering pace for years as the band's founder Robin Anton told Mail in Line she was doing everything she could to make it happen back in August 2015. A group insider told the Sun talk of the girls getting back together has been right for a few years now, and they have finally found a time which works for them all pictured in 2008 Robin, now 56 who founded the modern burlesque troupe The Pussycat Dolls in 1995, said in 2015 she had been in talks with band members to make the reunion happen sooner rather than later. She told Mail Online the history of reunions is something that everyone always wants and looks forward to, and I believe that, when the time comes for the Pussycat Dolls reunion, it will be massive. I have spoken with all of the girls about it a lot, and I truly believe that's going to happen in the very near future. I just spoke to Nicole and told her about this interview and she said, you can tell them I'm totally down for it. Star performers rumors of the reunion have been gathering pace for years as founder Robin Anton said she was doing everything she could to make it happen back in August 2015 making a big riding on the wave of the girl power phenomenon started by the Spice Girls in the 1990s, the dolls pictured in 2009 then went on to dominate the charts with catchy hits and sizzling music videos throughout the noughties with songs such as Stiquito and Button Skim and I have also been talking openly about a reunion on Instagram, so we're definitely putting it out there. I'm going to do everything I can to make it happen, and I know all the girls feel the same way. It's just about timing, and all of the different pieces of the puzzle coming together. I want it and the girls want it, and everyone else wants it, then it's going to happen. And Robin added that Nicole is key to any reunion, saying Nicole is one of the hardest working singers and dancers I know. She never once turned up to work and said, I'm so tired, even when I knew that she was. She worked so hard, all of the girls did. I've never seen a group work so hard for it and want it so much.